hi guys welcome back to my channel my name is Timmy Banjo if it's your first time here welcome and if you're stopping by welcome please if you haven't subscribed to my youtube channel please kindly consider hitting the subscribe button and also the notification bell so you get a notification whenever I upload a new video anyways let's get into this video Okay, so I've had these braids. They call it the goddess braids, as you can see. I've had these braids for like three days. This is today is Wednesday. I made this hair on Monday, and I'm in love. This hair is like the goddess braids, but there are some they make. It's, they use other brands of hair that cost almost a cow, a goat, a a lamb. <laughs> but this is just the regular um attachment i use darling hair or expression whichever it is i can't remember so i'm going to be teaching you guys how to style your braids in not just one not just two but not just five but six ways so if you want to see how you can style your braids in six different ways make sure you keep watching this video okay so now that i've moved back you'll be seeing i'm very close to my dressing table so if you see a little bit of mess just ignore it because i just finished wearing makeup so i'm going to start with the normal very normal and common type of styling or the type of style which is the full bun and that's all the way to the top so i'm just going to pack my hair like that and let's see So what you want to do is start with this part of your hair not just not everything and begin to roll look at that so this is the first style i'm going to be doing this is the common bun we see every day so look how just look how pretty it looks so this next one i'm going to do is going to be instead of the first one i did but is the bone is just going to be in front and thank goodness this is box braids there are lines in my hair really really defined demarcation so i know where to part my hair and i know where the line goes through so i'm just going to part my hair to make a bone in front So this is style number two and I really love this style because this looks more like a party look and I love the fact that my braids has defined lines so it looks really neat as I tied up the bun here and you can put the rest of the hair in front, you can put it at the back, you can put one side in front and the rest at the back. So I'm moving to the third style now. This is like a messy bun. I tried to make it as messy as I could, but my perfection, <laughs> but the perfection in me was just for choosing. All right. So this is like a messy bun. You pack your hair in a messy bun at the back, so and have two fringe in front. So this looks really nice and wearable for school, for work, wherever you are going. I mean, it looks really versatile and the reason why i made it messy was because it had to go with the two ones in front here because if this is really tight and up up 
there it looks really really serious for this to be out so try and make your bun as messy as possible so when this two is out it goes with the flow okay for this next one you have to be you have to take your time while doing it especially if you are wearing makeup like i am because you might end up cleaning your eyebrows you will put out some because it's going to be like a side part So this is what it looks like it's like a side part and um and up to and you can end up packing this in a bun if you want so let me just do that wow i think it looks better being in a bun like this looks really really flirty So for this next style you have to pull your sleeves first of all okay so i'll locate the center of my hair and have two this looks really really playful i love this hairstyle too or i love this style rather and when you are doing this hairstyle or when you are doing this packing make sure these two are symmetrical because you end up losing one trying to make it look like the other so i partitioned it and like i calculated how the symmetry was going to be you notice i was partitioning it partitioning it from the middle and the two sides at the back so this is what this looks like and you can leave this at the back you can bring this to the front and it looks really cool in front it looks really playful in front so yeah and you can just put one in front and the other one at the back so whichever one works for you it's fine okay so for this next one it looks quite similar to something i've done before and it's quite easy also so i'm just going to like as usual look for the parts of my hair okay the last one i did i ended up making this part of my hair a total bun like i rounded it up but now i made it fall out and you know join the other braids okay so i know i mentioned six hairstyles but i'm just going to add another one which is the common packing we all know and it's the regular updo so i'm just going to pack my hair like that because so when i tried it like that my hair really looked my hair looked really nice and i don't know what's filming these days i'm not understanding i might just start doing tutorials in yoruba language this is the final and 
the last look and this of all the looks i love this one because this just snatched my face from wherever it was coming from <laughs> so i love how this makes my face look look really really slim and <laughs> So if you enjoyed this video, which I know you did because you made it up to this point, put your thumb where your mouth is and hit that like button. And also, if you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel, please kindly hit the subscribe button because it will mean a lot to me if you will subscribe to my channel. Come on, let's make it official. Let's make this commitment. So please kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel and like this video if you haven't liked it. Hit the notification bell also and while you are here mm -hmm, you might as well watch another video and watch another video and watch another video because it's Timmy Banjo. Alright, thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you in my next video. Bye! Mwah.